hey guys welcome to digital trade youtube channel and in this video i'll be talking about a uh, software uh, or application called apollo.io uh, it is a lead generation tool by using which you can find verified emails of key decision makers like founders and ceos and managers etc so this is going to be a short overview of how you can find the emails and some basic features that you can use Apollo.io is basic a big tool where you can send mass emails, uh, send sequence of the emails and do the analytics analysis of the data. But in this particular video, I'll be talking only about how you can find the email addresses. So let's talk about the pricing first. As you can see, um, the pricing is you get at free of cost uh, 50 credits you get uh, if you choose the free plan and if you choose the basic plan you at nine dollars you get 200 emails per month uh, if you choose the professional plan that is 19 dollars you get unlimited email credits and 50 mobile numbers you can find of the people and there are some other things like you can do like you can do the a, a b testing uh, they give a dialer that with some free minutes uh, that you can use to call the numbers that you find from Apollo. Uh, you can record the calls and some other features that you get. Um, this uh, and if you want a custom um, plan, then you can talk to their sales team. Now, basically, they have unlimited email credits, but they are not truly unlimited. Uh, they are limited to ten thousand emails you can find in this plan, and I think they are enough if you use them wisely um, now talking about the pricing now this is the lowest pricing um, generally they price this at a bit higher now, generally this 19 dollars is not 19 it's 49 dollars but if you can get this at this price that i think that's a steal and you can subscribe to that annual plans um, in annual plans you will be paying only 15 dollars per month for 10,000 emails uh, now that is a really a good deal right so if you can get this just grab it so now let's talk about the software uh, let me log into my account so once i log in i will directly take you to the part where you can find the emails now this is the search bar now there are two type of things you can find here there are people and companies if you want the company data then you can go to the companies if you want the people person data like people person's email address then you can go to the people section now there are other sections too like engage and reach so you can find the emails then you can send the emails and then you can send the emails to your crm system do the data analysis and all that stuff so this is not the video i'm going to talk about uh, the in-depth tutorial i will talk about in some other video in this video i'll just talk about how you can find the emails now let's go to the section of people and you see this is the section on the left side left hand side there is a bar with different filters so you can target your audience right so suppose you have different audience like if you want to find founders right if you want to find founders of a startup suppose if you want to find founders now you can see there the poll has given you 1.2 million founder data they have now you don't need that much right you want to target specific audience so you can use these filters so there are different filters you can use if you want to find founders with organization where only 1 to 10 employees are there so you can use this if you want to find founders working in an organization with up to 20 employees then you can use this so you just I will just target 1 to 10 employees now if you want to find the industry right if you want to find computer software industry founders you just choose this depending on the industry that you want to target uh, now if you want to find a specific revenue so if you want uh, the organization to have only 1 million revenue in annually so you can choose those organizations only so you can do that now there are other like if you want to find startups with the specific fundings 
like if they are in their seed stage or in their angel stage series a stage so there are different startups and their funding stages so you can target that also and if you want to there are more other filters too let's see what are those now if you want to find the founding date right if you want new startup suppose so if you want to find a company uh, that are recently launched suppose you want to find company that is launched in 2021 so you can just type in that so you'll get all those companies that are established or founded in 21 and 22 and so on right so you can use this option if you want mm -hmm. Talking about other options, there are not other options important. So these are the other options that are useful when you are sending emails. So we are not covering that right now. Now this is very important. Other thing is email status. Email status are verified guess, no email, pending, bounce. So what are those? So basically all these emails on this platform is not 100% accurate, right? So the software is categorizing these emails into different things like depending on their capability to verify the emails so you always want emails that are 100% verified because if you choose them and send mass emails you don't want much bounce rate right now the guest emails are those that the software is not 100% sure so it just guess the emails so you can send those emails but the chances of getting it bounce is much much higher now this is no email so if the software could not find the email now pending manual verification means the software is aid to do the verification process on this bounce are those that will get bounce so you should not send these emails so always choose verified now again in, even if you choose verified the emails that you get are although they are very much accurate they are again 90 80 to 90 percent accurate but there will see there will be some five to ten percent emails that will get bounced so to the solution to this is go to the gmas.co and they have a free email verification tool so use the third party tool to verify the emails that you get from this platform and then send the mass emails so that is how you can work upon right now you can apply the filter over here now you will see in this section that there are three sections total net new and saved a total are the all the emails that the software has given to you net new means all the emails that you have not previously discovered and the saved is previously you have viewed these emails right and you have saved them in your system so net new is the one that are very new and you have not saved them in your account previously so what you have to do is how to find it right so all you have to do is select the emails that you want to find suppose i want to find so on one page only you can find 25 emails at a time so suppose you don't have a customized plan so this is the limitation so at a time you can just select mass select 25 emails so they have selected this 25 emails now all you have to do is click on save um, now this is all the email section if you are if you want to create a list suppose you want to create a list just with founders right you can create a list with founders just confirm right just click on confirm and you can see they are finished adding this prospect so we are able to find the emails of all this prospect now all these emails will go into the saved section now you can see there are only 25 now 10 emails now once i click on it you can see it is 35 right so all those 25 emails are now on the system now this is the way you find the emails here i hope, hope you got what i have say so these emails let me move this bar so these are the emails that you are not found so this this is the section right 35 so 35 emails you have found right now now how do you export them now, now before that let me talk about <clears throat> one important thing is the columns right so these are different columns that the software gives you you can you know customize them according to you
you can change the view table view you can do or you can do the list view depending on your preference you can also import contacts right so suppose you have a list of contacts that you want to import into the system and send use this apollo to send those contacts emails so you can do that using this option now table column settings so this is very important because this this view you are not get seeing everything here right so now you don't want you might not want to see parent accounts or you want might want to import some other tables here so you can do that with the help of this table column settings so you can see here all those different data they have but here visible columns does not have all this data right so you can just suppose i want account engagement so i just added this into my table view right so and if suppose i don't want parent account so i'll just delete from here so i don't want that view into my table so i'll just delete that if you want new things from here company city you can just import it and it will show it over here you just click save now you can see the parent account is gone but the company city is now you can visible so this is the customization of the table view now let's talk about export so suppose you found the 35 contacts now so now you want to export it to the excel sheet right so all you do is just click now there is no limit right if you have all the if you have here thousand contacts then you can just import export all of them at one go so there is no limit but while finding the contacts uh, you can just find 25 contacts at a time and uh, the, so you have to move like that way right first 25 then 25 but once your contact is saved then you can just type in like if i want to export all the 35 contacts i will just type in 35 and just uh, apply 30 selection right now what you'll do is it select all these 35 contacts now obviously i want to not email but if you want to email you can email but i just want to export it so i'll just click on export and you can export guest emails but here once you choose once you choose here verified then you don't have to worry you only get verified emails so all you have to do is click on start export so now you have your file is ready so just download it now let me show you the file how the file outcome looks like in my excel sheet you can see oh, hope you are seeing is um, the first name last name I can see the titles um, I can see the emails of the people that I got so these are all verified emails and all other details that you can get in the Excel sheet right so that's how um, so that's how the lead generation or contact finding works right so i hope you got the overview basic overview of how this software works uh, if you have any doubts do comment below um, now you can also find company details right suppose you want to find employees um company names right suppose you want to find company name you, you're not going to get the emails but you're going to get company uh details right suppose you want to find uh, come organization with up to 10 employees uh, you want to find organization in computer software uh if you want to find organization with less than 1 million revenue and yeah titles title is not relevant here because we just we are just going to get company details so you can just select those things now the another thing that they have is apollo.io chrome extension so with this chrome extension what you can do is find email address from linkedin accounts and also you can find email address from any website so that is very useful tool let's try using that uh, this tool suppose i want to find the email address of some random person suppose let's see obviously you will not find email addresses of every person but most of them you will find out so as you can see i found this email address of ritesh singh 
uh, and the email address is verified so this is what the cold uh, extension does you get the email address right on your from your linkedin account or from any random websites you get their phone number you get all the details of the company they are working in and in the insights you can see the technology the company is using if they are hiring if they are receiving any fundings and you will see all the employees of this company right so this is a very useful tool again uh, and this tool you can also use with linkedin sales navigator suppose you have a suppose you have a linkedin sales navigator account and you are using their filters there these filters are similar to apollo.io uh, again you can filter by location industry company head account and job titles etc suppose you have this tool so suppose you got this list of contacts and you want to save them in your apollo system so all you all you, and want to find their email addresses all you have to do is click on this and just need to click on this and click here save as you can see all the contacts from your linkedin sales navigator are now saved in your apollo right so you can do this like you can just have to go to the next page now and the contacts that you want to find uh, select those contacts click on here save those contacts they get saved now you can view those contact in apollo Uh, the apollo contacts you can view those contacts in your apollo system now it's taking some time but it's going to open so as you can see all those saved contacts uh, are now saved like we saved 25 contacts from linkedin so all these contacts you can see now obviously not all emails will be verified so make sure you only filter those emails that are verified you can do that uh, using this uh, linkedin verification option you can click here email status you just want email verified so let me just put this aside and you just want verified emails so just click on verified emails and it will only show you now all the verified emails and just you can export them to your system so that's about it that's the overview basic overview this is not an in-depth tutorial of how to generate leads and you can also send emails and other features that have but today i just discussed uh, discuss about this uh, lead generation or email finding tools i think this is number one or number two tool in the market right now depend um, it is very cost friendly uh, in 19 dollars you are getting 10,000 emails so that is very good uh, so i would definitely recommend this tool and if you want more such videos then do subscribe to my youtube channel i talk about SaaS, online money making videos and internet marketing as a whole so do subscribe to my, my youtube channel and it motivates me see you in my next video